an incredible body of work by Steve McCurry, star of the international photography stage, is currently on display at Florence's Villa Bardini. The large-scale retrospective, titled Icons, brings together some 100 of the masterful Steve McCurry's works. A Philadelphia native and former newspaper worker who burst onto the international photography scene after a trip through India and Afghanistan, McCurry is especially well known for his portrait work and for putting a human face to many international crises and conflicts. The exhibition begins with images from those very first trips in his 20s and moves through many decades and countries in the following rooms, Burma, Japan, Brazil, Peru, and many others. Of course, one of the standout pieces in the exhibition is the reproduction of Afghan Girl, a 1984 portrait of Sharbat Gula, who McCurry photographed in a refugee camp in Pakistan. Gula's stunning green eyes and pointed expression made her an icon of the period of Soviet occupation in Afghanistan after McCurry's photograph was used on the cover of National Geographic. Her identity was unknown at the time of publication, but a video portion of the exhibition produced by National Geographic explores McCurry's search to find and connect with Gula 17 years after the photograph was taken. But the Afghan girl is far from the only portrait deserving of attention. Faces showing the full range of human emotion and highlighting the universality of certain experiences crop up at every corner in this show. Beyond portraiture, McCurry's work also includes landscapes, always with a human element, and images of war and conflict, daily life, and street photography. McCurry is known for his uncanny ability to bring seemingly distant lands down to earth, never otherizing the unfamiliar for Western audiences. McCurry's work spans 30 years and six continents. The stories captured in his pieces are of disappearing cultures, enduring ancient traditions, and commonalities of contemporary life across borders. He's a four-time first prize winner of the World Press Photo Competition. See this striking collection of photographs at Villa Bardini until September 16, 2018.